Hey guys, welcome back to another brand new video. In this video, guys, I want to talk about Terra Luna 2.0. I want to talk about why I told you guys that Terra Luna 2.0 was in fact a pump and a dump. Because pretty much, guys, it was right. So in this video, I want to talk about it, right? So before I get into this video, guys, please give this video a huge thumbs up and of course subscribe if you guys haven't already. Let's get to two thousand subscribers in less than one month time i know we can do it so guys if you haven't considered subscribing please subscribe i do upload videos every single day and i don't just upload one video i literally upload multiple videos daily okay on a day-to-day -day basis right i literally upload about you know five to six even seven sometimes videos a day right so if you want to learn about crypto if you want to learn how to make money with crypto please consider subscribing guys right so let's get started with this video and guys before we talk about terra luna 2.0 i want to talk about the whole crypto market and go through it with you guys because the whole market right now is bouncing back up okay for all the people out there that were panicking that were panic selling that were extremely fearful you know what i mean you just have to wait you just have to be patient and now look right we are bouncing back up guys bitcoin right is in fact bouncing back up it's having a great great pump um as you guys can see right here it is in fact bouncing back up to where it was um a couple of days ago may 23rd right so this was like literally like last week so now it's pumping back up to uh forty three uh thousand dollars right and pretty much guys the whole market's pretty much looking really really good you know it's not it's not looking too bad Right, but even though yes, we are still in fact in the bear market, and I won't be surprised if it does dip again. Right, I'm just saying. Okay, I would, I just wouldn't be surprised. So Ethereum, right, is up over six percent for the past 24 hours. XRP up almost five percent. Right, Cardano up almost 12 percent for the past 24 hours. Solana almost up 10 percent. Dogecoin up almost six percent. Polkadot up almost 11 percent. Avalanche is up almost 12 percent shiba inu is up over 14 percent polygon up almost nine percent litecoin looking pretty good up over six percent uh chain link wow had a pretty decent pump almost up 12 percent cosmos add up up almost nine percent algorand almost up 11 percent as you can see right there apecoin up almost 12 percent hezos uh almost 10 percent so yeah most old coins are looking really really good guys we are in fact having a bounce back up um so this is obviously a great sign right here guys so for all the people that are saying that crypto is dead no it's not guys it's still like and obviously we will over time okay i'm not gonna say like I'm not going to say like this is going to happen in like a week time or even a few months time but we will get out of the bear market right and hopefully fingers crossed we do get out of the bear market and like maybe sometime next year maybe or sometime this year that'll be good to see you know what i mean um but we're just gonna have to see you know what i mean so guys there's still you know a lot of room to tell if if bitcoin for example can hit you know one hundred thousand dollars sometime this year in 2022 because i do see that happening you know my personal price prediction for bitcoin this year in 2022 is to hit a hundred thousand dollars right and obviously you know we didn't, we're not even halfway through the year yet okay it's only may it's about to be june right once it hits june yes it will be halfway through the year but we still have a lot of time to see where bitcoin will be where ethereum will be and pretty much the whole crypto market will be right if we will get you know bounce back out of the you know bear market and go to the bull market right so time will tell we just have to be really 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 patient guys okay we just have to be patient it's all about patience here. remember guys we always think long term we are not traders we're not day traders we are cryptocurrency investors guys we are investors we invest our money into crypto for long term because trust me guys okay i'm not no financial advisor you guys should honestly do your own research but i'm telling guys this right now i've said this many times and i'm always going to repeat myself and i'll say it again you will make the most money long term long term gains that is where you'll make the most money then short term gains short term profits right it's always long term guys trust me so that's that guys you know the whole crypto market is looking really really good that is good to see so let's talk about terra luna 2.0 now okay there's a lot to talk about okay um and i told you guys right even when terra luna 2.0 was about to launch okay it wasn't even launched yet it wasn't live right you couldn't start trading with it i told you guys that terra luna 2.0 i had a feeling 
that maybe the first few hours or even the first few days it would pump a lot of people will foam it there's going to be a lot of FOMO, right and that's exactly what happened okay if we go to the seven day chart right here as you guys can see uh matter of fact let's go to the one month chart as you guys can see right here, this was its highest peak, $27, over $27, right? Tower Luna 2.0 at one point was in fact at $27, over $27, almost $28, right? And this was May 28th. This was literally two days ago. And ever since then, guys, as you can see, right, we've been going down, okay? And then we've just been pretty much going on a straight line right here, okay? It's just been consolidating. Not Nothing fancy is still happening. We haven't had a bounce back up, right? So... If we go to the one day chart right we are in fact slightly going back up here but if we just zoom out yeah it's not looking too good guys i told you guys that terra luna 2.0 was in fact going to be a pump and a dump right so i hope you guys didn't buy at the top you know what i mean like when it was up here you know over 20 dollars or even when it was like at 15 dollars. i feel like terra luna 2.0 will dump even more it will dip in fact even more guys right and you know a lot of you guys are asking me like, what would you rather buy? Terra Luna 2.0, right? The new chain, right? The new blockchain, the new cryptocurrency, right? Terra Luna 2.0, or would you buy Terra Classic, the original, right? The original um, cryptocurrency for Terra. And honestly, with you guys, I would honestly rather buy Terra Classic, right? Why? Why do I say that? Why do I pick Terra Classic? It's because Terra Classic, guys, you know, this is, in fact, the original cryptocurrency, right? There is nothing wrong with Terra Luna Classic. There really isn't nothing wrong with it. I just feel like, you know, I I, I honestly agree with most, most of you guys because a lot of people, right, are in fact upset that, you know, they created a whole new token, a whole new, you know, cryptocurrency, you know, chain, right, for Terra Luna, right, which is called Terra Luna 2.0 pretty much, right? This is it right here. Um, So they created this and they pretty much ditched Terra Classic. They just like left it. You know what I mean? Like they just left it, right? So a lot of people are upset, are upset about that. And I, I totally, you know, I totally do agree with them. You know, I really do, right? I totally do agree with them. I understand where they're coming from, right? And this is the thing, guys. Terra Luna Classic is up almost 50% versus Terra Luna 2.0 it is down, you know, 0.22%, right? So nothing really interesting is in fact happening with Terra Luna 2.0, but Terra Classic is pumping guys look at this it is in fact pumping right so this is the charts for Terra Luna classic okay and as you can see it is in fact pumping it is up over 50 percent as you can see right so it is in fact pumping um which is a good sign right here right it did have a little dip uh right here you know we were in fact like around up here now as you can see, we did have this little dip right here, but we are now in fact bouncing back up, which is a good sign to see, right? It's a great time, uh, great sign to see. So guys, like I said many times, I would honestly rather buy Terra Classic than Terra Luna 2.0. You know what I mean? I just that's just my own personal opinion. You know what I mean? A lot of people think Terra Classic is dead, right? In a way, yes, it is because you know it's still above. You know, it's still below, sorry, it's still below a penny, a cent, right? It hasn't really reached, you know, a cent yet or a couple cents yet or even a dollar, right? And I do see that happening. You know, I'm not going to lie here. Terra Classic, yes, there's a high chance that yes, okay, it could hit a couple cents, right? But hitting a dollar, I do see that happening, okay? I do see that happening, right? But to get there, right, it's going to, you know change a lot of things like we have to go through a lot of things to get terra classic right terra luna classic to one dollar right there are some specific things in fact guys i'm gonna go ahead and make a whole separate video to talk about this right that terra classic okay terra luna classic could actually hit one dollar right i'm gonna make a whole separate video about that in a couple hours time so hopefully stay tuned for that guys okay so hopefully you guys will stay tuned for that video coming out in a couple hours time what you guys are watching this video Okay, so stay tuned for that. But yes, guys, I really do believe that Terra Luna 2.0 was in fact a pump and a dump. You guys let me know in the comments below. Like, look at this. It was all the way up here. Now we're back down here. So this is completely a pump and a dump pretty much, right? So if you guys don't see this, then I don't know. You must be blind. But personally, guys, I am not buying Terra Luna 2.0. If anything, I would rather buy Terra Luna Classic, the original Terra Luna 
cryptocurrency, right? So that's just my own personal opinion. You guys let me know in the comments down below, what would you guys rather buy? Terra Luna 2.0, the new cryptocurrency, or Terra Luna Classic, the original cryptocurrency. Let me know in the comments down below which one you guys would rather buy. Personally, I would buy Classic, right? That's just my own personal opinion. Um, but yeah, guys, that's that for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Like I said, stay tuned. In a couple hours time, I will talk about Terra Luna Classic if it could actually potentially reach $1. I want to talk about it with you guys, so stay tuned for that video. It's going to be a really good one, and it's going to be a really important one. So stay tuned, guys, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give this video a huge thumbs up, and of course, subscribe. If you guys have not yet already, I really would appreciate that. And I'll catch you guys in my next video. Have a good one, guys.